I would say my workout is everything. Your workout is a good direct relation on how in tune you are with your body, how in shape you are, uh, how good you feel. You know, there's days you walk in the gym and you feel like just complete and utter shit. There's days you walk in and you feel like you're King Kong. So it's just, it's a grind. Uh, same thing with bullfighting. There's days you go out there and just whoop on one and you're untouchable. And there's days you get hooked by a calf and you're like, what the fuck? So uh, I like to start my day out with, you know, good breakfast and a good workout. And that just kind of sets your whole demeanor for the rest of the day. You know, if I were to not come in here, in the back of my mind, I'd be like, you didn't put in the work today. You didn't get up. Who went to the gym and you didn't, you know? I come down here and shit, look who's down here, you know? So who's who a bullfighting? It's just a reminder. It's the game's changing. If you're not willing to change with it, you'll get left behind. I love coming in here when the boys are all, you know, in town. And, you know, we feed off each other's energy, you know? You know, I added stuff to my workout. Mercer's put a great year together and ultimately came out here and, and did exactly what he needed to do. You know, he's the only guy I've ever known to put on a pair of cleats and win the world first year doing it. You know, you kind of start fighting bulls and you start fighting bulls good and proving yourself and they just kind of accept you. Um, it's kind of one of their own and it's, it's a really kind of, of a surreal feeling. How, how fast I got accepted, you know, and uh, it pushed me to be, you know, on the next level. Like, we, we, we've all worked out together, you know, me and Joe's and Weston and Fur and, you know, Tuck and all them guys. And, you know, we just feed off each other and we kind of get comfortable working around each other. So it's, it's really cool how we can, you know, want to kick each other's ass in the ring, but want to build each other up at the exact same time. So it's, it's, it's a badass feeling. Yeah, you know, there's always been great competition, but for me, there's never been somebody to test me like this. And, you know, hindsight 2020, I didn't win. But this will be the best thing that ever happened to me. I'll, I'll take this. And there was a lot of things that happened this year that I should have done better. And now looking back at it, you know, that's what cost me. So I'll make 2019 the best thing that ever happened to West North Council. I've been the only champ up until this year, and that's something I don't take lightly. I wanted to win nine, 10 in a row, you know, be the only guy to ever do it and ultimately be the greatest freestyle bullfighter there's ever been. Now there's been somebody that's all of a sudden a pressing matter and I'm not gonna go out like that. You know, like I said, hats off to Aaron Mercer on a great year and I'm coming, there's, there's no doubt about it. This is my league, this is my, my town and this is my tent and it'll never change.